In our health alert tonight, a new more toxic strain of strep has been discovered and it's causing outbreaks of scarlet fever in Britain. But tonight, experts tell us it could arrive right here in the U.S. any day now. Our chief health editor, Dr. Parthenani, joins us now with more on what we know about this strain. Doc? Alan, uh, first of all, let me start by explaining strep, what it is. It's a group of bacteria known as group A streptococcus or group A strep. It's often found in the throat, on the skin, and can cause many different infections like strep throat and scarlet fever. So why is this new strain a, a concern? Well, first of all, because of the upswing in scarlet fever cases, in 2014, there were 15,000 cases reported. By 2016, there were over 19,000 cases. That's a big increase, right? So researchers investigated and discovered a particular strain that had changed. It had developed 27 small mutations, and they're calling the strain M1UK. And what's concerning is that scientists say this strain is more fit and more capable of causing throat infections. It can also make more of the scarlet fever toxins. So that's worrisome. It definitely is. So does this new strain respond well to treatment? So Heather, the, the good news is that this strain can be cured with antibiotics. Now infections often peak between March and May, but parents should still be mindful of any symptoms like sore throats, fevers, swelling lymph nodes, congestion, or a red rash if they have scarlet fever. Now both scarlet fever and strep throat are spread through coughing or sneezing. Tiny little droplets fly through the air and others nearby can unknowingly breathe them in. You can also catch strep by touching or sharing contaminated objects. You gotta be careful. So doctor, a lot of people are probably wondering right now, how dangerous are strep infections? So Alan, if strep infections are not treated, the bacteria can enter the blood or tissue and spread throughout the body, and it can lead to sepsis, toxic shock, and death. Here in the U.S., we have between 11 and 15,000 cases a year of invasive strep. About 1,500 folks actually die. So if you think your child has strep, super important. Please be sure to take them to your doctor who can diagnose and treat them. I had strep as a kid, and it almost took my life. So it's really important to take these messages seriously. Wow, great advice. All right, thank you so much, Doc. And if you have a question or health concern for the doctor, you can email him, drnandy at askdrnandy.com, or send it to us on Facebook or Twitter.